Everybody, you're watching Max Tutorial Films. I'm Arian, and today I just want to show you how to uh, make a video layout for your Black Ops gameplay. Um, a lot of people have been asking for this tutorial because they've seen my uh, example that I have made, and I posted it on my other channel, which is free gameplay. If you want to check out some Black Ops gameplay, um, go to this channel. I'll have the link in the description below. And yeah, so this is what it pretty much looks like self explanatory. Tells you weapons, perks, kill streaks, equipment, and it shows you your status board. Uh, you know, updates whenever you get a kill or death, etc. So this tutorial will be broken into two different parts. The first part will be uh, first part being the layout itself, which is Photoshop. It's all done in Photoshop, and um, I will have some links uh, to the images. Such as kill streaks, perks, and the weapons. There are several links. Um, I'll put them in the description below, along with the channel for gameplay. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. Now, before um, you know, we get right into the designing and stuff. You want to make sure you're when you start your new project. Um, you have to size it correctly to match the uh, HD composition for your video. Um, this is recommended. Uh, if you want HD, you follow these steps. So make sure they're pixels, and make sure your width is 1280, and your height will be 720. So it's 1280 by 720 pixels, which is an uh, HD layout. And uh, so I already have it opened. And uh, this is the background layer. And for the background layer, I'm just gonna do a uh, quick gradient. I'm gonna grab some gray. A dark navy blue. And I'm gonna select the gradient tool. And there you go. Yeah. Stretch that more. There you go. Now this is just gonna be the background layer. Um, since I'm this, this is gonna be a very long process to do, and it's gonna be up to your design. I'm just gonna skim through of the process and the steps of what I've done, and uh, I'm not gonna go into too much detail. Um, that's all up to you. Depending on what you want it to look like, but first off, um, before I, d I put in any images or start anything like that, I want to make the template for my video. So what I will do is go to make sure it's black. So when you put in uh, After Effects, it'll be visible. We're gonna select the rectangle tool and we're gonna match it the same size as the background, which is 1280 by 720. Make sure it's there's no style. So it'll just be a black screen. And what we want to do is we're gonna scale it down to um, 75%. So to do this, you're gonna sorry uh, to do this, you want to do Command T or Control T if you're on a PC to do a free transform, make it 75% by 75%. Um, hit enter. Now let's just drag this up here. You know, whatever you want, drag it wherever. But I'm going based on the design I showed you in the channel so yeah that's where your video is going to be and uh, make sure it's exactly the same size as your background because it's going to be the same aspect ratio only difference is going to be scaled down to 75 percent and uh, yeah so next steps um, pretty much you know uh, all your ideas it doesn't have to go based on mine, but I'm gonna show you what I've done. So I first made the borders. By doing this, I went to the rounded rectangle tool and make sure your style is on the outline, and just pretty much drew out all the borders. And then add in the titles such as primary, secondary equipment, kill streaks, perks, and then uh, I've entered the status board, which says game type. And kills, deaths, kill streaks, and this is where After Effects plays a part in updating your status for kills, uh, etc. Then uh, I've added in the images, and the images, um, as I said, are going to be given to you in the description via links, websites, which I found them from. And uh, I added them in, uh, such as the weapons. And then, you know, the names, stuff like that. The attachments. Then I have the equipment. And the 
kill streaks and the perks. And a lot of the images you're gonna have to do cropping out and uh, using the lasso tool or go to color range, select color range to key out the white background because a lot of the images have white backgrounds. And these are PNG files, so you can just simply drag and drop it. But I'm not gonna go uh, too far into detail with that. So yeah, pretty much this is how the video layout would look like. And whatever your design is, just remember that the video um, template has to be the exact same aspect ratio as your um, video layout. In this case, it's HD, which is 1280 by 720. So this is just part one for the uh, Photoshop. And um, I'm going to jump to part two for the After Effects. Okay, now we're in After Effects, and uh, what I've done is just drag the video into the composition along with the video layout. It's right beneath it. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to match this video with the video template on the layout. <clears throat> and to do this, I'm going to go to the video itself, go to the arrow next to it, go to Transform, and we're going to go to Scale. And if you remember, when we're in Photoshop, we made the template for the video 75%. <clears throat> Of the aspect rate, the original aspect ratio, or sorry, same aspect ratio and the 75% uh, of the size of the video layout. So it was 75%, and we're gonna type in 75% in the scale enter, and just drag it right on top of it, and it should fit perfectly, like so. So check it out. All right. Um, now what we want to do is we're going to update the scoreboard or status board, whatever you want to call it, for every kill and every death and every kill streak. Um, so to do this, we are going to select a base, just select the text tool, and we're going to just type in zero. Let's zoom in a bit. I'm just going to show you. The text type zero and uh, let's make the font a little bigger. Just like that. And I'm going to hit enter. And I want to duplicate this layer three times. So Command D or Control D. And we're just going to move them down. Just like that. So pretty easy, right? Just dragging the text in. Okay, now what we want to do is update them. And to do this, let's find a part where I get a kill. Um, right here. So I get a kill right here. Let's just right there. We're gonna go to the kills. Select one. Select the layer that that has kills, and we're gonna go to uh, the arrow next to it. Go to text, go to source text, and hit the timer, and it's gonna start a keyframe. And we're gonna change the text to one. So before we do that, command right key to go to the next keyframe, and then we're gonna go back into the text and re-edit it, make it one kill, and hit enter and it's going to create a new keyframe so it's going to be zero and it changes to one okay and we're going to find the second kill of the scene and right here we'll go back delete two and hit enter and it creates a new keyframe so the update from one to two okay we're gonna do the same exact thing with the uh, deaths. Uh, for the deaths, it's just one. We so far died once until the next death, but uh, we're gonna go to kill streak and just do the same exact thing. Kill streak when it hits one. Right there. Uh, we're going to do the same exact thing, go to text, source path, and next keyframe, and make this one, or 
Oh, sorry. We have to go back. Hit the keyframe for the wall. Insert. There you go. So that's pretty much it. It's very simple. Uh, you just gotta, you know, takes a bit of time to find each kill and then update it and so on and so on. So that's pretty much how you do it. So you're gonna go to the source path of the text, hit the timer, and start animating. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, very simple. I uh, hope this tutorial helped a lot. Uh, please give it a thumbs up. Favorite it if you really like it. You know, you want to use it to uh, help you make yours. And don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials like this. And again, check out my other channel for gameplay, which is Rate Gaming Clan. And that is pretty much it, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, ask. Um, yeah. Bye, guys.